Love is indeed the ultimate conjecture amidst the cool palm of ecstasy. And we begin our travel upon the path of marriage. In bloom of awakened eyes, we shall illuminate upon each other mirth and happy wonder. Our first day on that memorable May 12, 2017 remains etched in my heart. We set off for a hike, but it turns out our sense of direction was about as reliable as a GPS with a faulty battery, and we got lost. Despite the circumstances, you were a true gentleman. With love, there may be sultry words, vulnerable deeds, and unharnessed kisses. We must do our best not to hurry or to perch on this earthly experience with vacant stares or succumb to our tired eyes of work and toil, but rather hug each other with wanderlust smiles, words of understanding and compassion. Te amo, mi dulce amor. <laughs> <clears throat> when fate brought us together on that group hike, it felt as if we had known each other for a thousand years. You said, it was nice to see you today. Glad you made it out. Don't worry, it gets easier. Smooth, David, real smooth. But those simple words sparked a curiosity within me. I remember that one day as we embarked on a quick jaunt up a hill in Oakland, something magical happened. It was there in the midst of nature's embrace that we shared our first kiss. But life had its twists and turns, and for a while, our paths diverged. Yet, God also has his own plans, and your sweet messages kept our connection. I thank God every day for you. I promise to love you every day, each day more than the last, with love as our compass and laughter as our hiking boots. I'm so ready to embark on this incredible adventure with you. I love you. Well, we're gathered here to seal a covenant of love. And as we stand here in this remarkably beautiful place that you two have chosen, I have no question that we're about to experience something remarkable and be part of something truly supernatural as the two of you enter into a lifelong covenant of love with each other. And so it's fitting that we recognize the sanctity and the honor of this moment. What about this? There's a word called Eros, that speaks of passion, fire, chemistry, attraction. Do you guys have anything like that for each other? <laughs> okay. Woo, that's a good sign. Okay, I think the answer is yes. I want to encourage you, that too is a gift from God. Understanding the truths we have just spoken of and the power and the meaning of the commitment you are making to each other. I ask you now, Dave, do you take Eileen to be your wife? Do you promise to love her, to give your heart to her alone, to protect her and care for her for as long as you both shall live? I do. Eileen, do you take Dave to be your husband? Do you promise to love him, to give your heart to him alone, to nurture and care for him for as long as you both shall live? I do. Beautiful. It is my privilege under the laws of the state of Colorado to pronounce you now husband and wife. Dave, you may kiss your bride. 